Hey guys, welcome to my uh, second review for tonight. I was asked to uh, do another test, um, and this one was concerning a vast, the new one, uh, coupled with threat fire, which is a behavior analyzer, blocker, whatever you want to call it. So I just want to show you that uh, this is updated. Now these are the same um, links that I used in my other video that I made tonight. That was AVG and Zone Alarm. Uh, the only thing that this combination is missing, in my opinion, is a good firewall. Uh, but there's different, there's definitely different firewalls out there you could try that are very good. Uh, PC Tools, I think Outpost. Um, Komodo, of course. I mean, there's there's enough firewalls you could try to put with this combination that would work well. Okay, that got blocked, so that's good. Looks like that first one didn't get blocked. Uh, maybe it did. Looks like that one doesn't work anymore. Or either that or it blocked it. Okay, yeah, I blocked that last one and it just blocked this one too. So that's good. So far, um, I haven't seen anything from Threat Fire. Okay, there you go. Now threat fire comes in. Moderate risk here. Register itself. Windows startup. So kill and quarantine the process. And that that KKA is dead. I think this one's dead too. No, oh, no works and that one's been blocked the web shield looks like that uh, rogue is finally gone Those were detected by a vast, and that has also been detected by that fire. So we will kill that. Looks like that one was blocked. And the last one. And that one was also blocked. And detected by Threat Fire. As a moderate. 
Okay, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to open up a vast. Looks like Threat Fire is still doing some work in the background. But I will do a quick scan. I always like to do quick scans. Um, I'll restart it later. So what I'll do is I'll do a quick scan, see if it finds anything. Um, if it does, I'll quarantine them, restart, and then check with Hitman Pro. Uh, whenever a program asks me to restart, to remove something, I like to do it just to see because sometimes there's different things loaded that it can't get rid of. So what I'll do is I'll be back after this uh, scan is done. So I'll see you in a second. Okay, so um, if I have finished the scan, scan 4.65 gigabytes, didn't find anything. And now I'm going to restart because uh, Threatfire asked me to. After restart, I'll go and grab uh, Hitman Pro. So I'll be right back. All right, so um, <clears throat> restarted, did a Hitman Pro scan, found two things. One of them is in temporary internet file, so it doesn't concern me much. And the other one is uh, that zip file that I downloaded, and um, I found whatever was inside the zip file uh, as a piece of malware. I'm sure that uh, this temp file, if you clean out your temporary internet files and temp files using a good program, you know, like... Uh, C cleaner or uh, Komodo system cleaner or whatever you want to use out there would definitely take care of these two files and uh, you wouldn't have to worry about anything. So it seems like the combination of those two did very well. The only thing that I want to check now is memory usage. Um, I want to make sure it's not real high. So let's see here. Got a vast. It's about 5.5 5 megabytes, so that's great. And I call that about 4 for threat fire. So under 10 megs, you have great protection. All that I would recommend for this thing is to get a good firewall. Um, anything um, that's uh, listed on this website. Let me take you there, I still got some time. Any other uh, top firewalls that have been tested here will work very well for protecting you. So if we look at the ratings here, we got Online Armor, uh, the free version. Uh, this is their new 148 test, which uh, they haven't been doing that long, so there's not a full list. We can also go back down here to their 84 tests. You can look uh, Komodo Inner Security, that's a free firewall, very good. Uh, PC Tools Firewall, really good. Uh, this is the paid version of Online Armor. This, that's the free version. Uh, Outpost did okay back then. Didn't do so hot this time, so they got some work to do on that. So I'd probably avoid that right now um, until they get some more work on it. But any any of the top firewalls that you see in purple here or uh, purple light blue here will do great. And uh, except Kapersky, uh, Kaspersky, I mean, is a sweet. So anything marked with free and is in the top right here it was great. And that's it. So um, everybody take care. I'll uh, upload this video soon. And uh, everybody have a good night.